with the shadows on the bedroom wall. Let's create a trailer. Hey guys, I'm Pascal from Orange Pixel and today we're going to talk about the trailer creation of Space Grunts 2. Uh, last couple of days, two days in fact, I've been working on the trailer for Space Grunts 2 and I just wanted to share the whole process and, and what did I do to create the trailer and how did I come to certain conclusions and decisions and things like that. Uh, I talked about the Gunslug trailer a few months ago, I'll put the link of that in the description below. Um, this trailer was a little bit different because I wasn't really sure what I wanted this trailer to be or show or so I didn't even know where to start. Which is a problem if you want to start on a project and you don't know where to start. So um, the first thing I did was pretty much very obvious. Um, I started playing the game and recording that gameplay session. Um, the idea was to have as much gameplay footage as possible. So get as far as possible in the game so that I can have uh, different levels and different things to show in the trailer. So it was just a video of like maybe five, six minutes of gameplay. Besides having that gameplay video, I also wanted the logo in high resolution uh, because I'm pretty sure that needs to be in the trailer. And I also wanted the voiceover sample that I created for the game because I think that creates a good intro to the whole thing and it sounds a bit like Star Trek so it has that Star Trek opening type thing. Now having done these weekly videos luckily I also learned a lot of editing tricks and I now have also a bunch of um, video files I can use which are very comparable to sound effects files except these are videos so I have a star field and I have a planet rotating and things like that so we're gonna dump all that into DaVinci Resolve which is the editing program I use uh, comparable to Adobe Premiere except it's a lot cheaper it's actually free if you don't need all the special stuff so uh, I dumped it all in there and then started uh, creating the timeline so there's a star field the planet the logo on top the sound sample in there and um, a little tweaking and, and tinkering here and there and we have our first part of the trailer which is uh, this Space Grounds Log, Stardate, uh, something, something. We beam down to the planet to investigate the distress signal. So this was an opening and it was a great starting point and I figured the rest of the editing was just adding gameplay footage of the key things and key elements of the game. And the first key feature that I wanted to show is the actual card battle mechanism because it's a top-down roguelike but it has card battling in there and I think that's still it's not a very common thing so it's a very uh, interesting and key feature to show. So what I did was I just took the gameplay clip I had and picked out a bunch of card battle areas. So uh, every time I was playing a card that little snippet of maybe a second, two seconds I dumped them all after each other and we ended up with a lot of cards flying on the screen and that really shows that this game isn't just a top-down roguelike but something else is happening with cards which hopefully makes the viewer interested in the game. Alright so now we have the intro and the card battle the first key feature. I was happy with the intro but it just needed the orange pixel logo in there somewhere and a little bit of an extra. So I added the orange pixel logo at the start of the video and I made it black and white to really um, depict the, the 60s, 70s style I'm aiming for, the old fashioned sci-fi. And then I created a little pixel art logo that said pixel color, uh, which is really also comparable to logos they had back in those days for things that were high colored and whatnot. And it's just a little wink and a little joke, but it adds a little bit of extra to the trailer and it looks pretty good. So that's what we added at the start of the intro. And now I'm pretty happy with how the intro looks. <laughs> Space Grounds Log, Stardate, uh, something, something. And that means the next stage is adding more gameplay. We don't just have card battles, we have a bunch of other things and deck building is done by collecting items. So I wanted to show that as well. So I started adding more gameplay elements, uh, showing all these things happening. And we ended up with a trailer of one minute and 30 seconds. And I still want to add a few more things though. We need to start cutting out a bunch of things. So 
So as much as I love the music in the game, it's great music done by Gavin, um, it doesn't seem to fit the trailer or at least it, it seems a bit too slow and a bit too... I, I'm not sure what it is, but it doesn't really keep you interested in the game. So I wanted a little bit of a different tune in there and started searching for creative common uh, music that I can just use and am allowed to use. And I found something that fits pretty well with the team, but also adds a little bit more of a cinematic feel to the trailer. So I removed most of the music except the intro and then uh, dumped the new music in there. I also cut out a bunch of stuff and uh, we ended up with a, a fairly decent trailer. Uh, two. Investigate the distress signal. Space Grunt's law started something, something. Investigate the distress signal. So at this point I left the trailer alone and the next day I just had a fresh eye, fresh mind and, and just watched the trailer and decided a few things needed to change. Um, first thing that I wanted to scratch and remove were all these text prompts uh, or most of them at least because I needed one or two but most of them didn't really have a function so I started cutting out those prompts and uh, ended up with a slightly shorter trailer and um, a faster speed to everything so uh, that's what the end trailer is now and it's available on YouTube on the channel right now you should be able to watch it I'll put a link to it in the description below as well and um, yeah I'm pretty happy with how the trailer ended up and that's it for this week's video I hope uh, there were some tips in there for other people trying to create trailers and um, if you want to see more of these type of videos check the description below there's a trailer creation for Gunslugs trailer creation for Sir Questionnaire so um, this is the third one. Every process is a little bit different than the others. So uh, there are tips everywhere and uh, check them out. Also, please check out Space Grunts 2. It's now available on the App Store. Uh, it's coming to Android pretty soon. And you can of course also get it on Steam for PC. Um, please try it if you like it, give it a little review. It helps me a lot. It helps other gamers find the game and it helps everybody in the end. So uh, please try out the game and um, I'll see you guys next week. Bye. So I added the Orange Pixel logo. Logo. That's gewoon Hollands. That's Dutch. I'm sorry. So I added the Orange Pixel logo. So I added the Orange Pixel logo at the uh, start. <laughs> there are birds tapping on my roof.